In the end, the answer to what has made Al Amatuzio so successful is the man himself. Al is Al. He's never pretended to be anything more or allowed himself to be anything less. And so, despite his phenomenal success, he's also a regular guy with a strong devotion to his family, friends, and the country that gave a boy from Raleigh Street the opportunity to make the most of his God-given talents. I think there's a guy that has never forgotten his roots. He is who he is from his humble beginnings, and that is still who he is. His success has not changed him. I mean, he's always Al. He's, he's one of this band of brothers. I know what makes him tick a secret of his genius is his interest. He's just very interested and enthusiastic. In, in his mind, I think he builds these virtual castles of what's going to happen and works things out. See, he, he sees things other people don't see. He never met anybody that is, is, is aware of opportunity and positive thinking as he is. And uh, he doesn't give up, and that's the fighting end of it, the flying end of it. I mean, if he makes up his mind he's going to do something, he will go to whatever lengths it takes to accomplish that. Say something that, that is hard to do, he wants to do it. Say something he can't do, you better watch out, because that's what he'll start doing. Al is a fighter. He's a tremendous fighter. And I don't mean in the sense that uh, you know, it has to do with fisticuffs. It's, it's his, his conceptual way of living life. He fights to, to give everyone the opportunity for a good life. He has always considered himself secondary to the primary goal. He is a great man. And his persistence is what has kept this company on the move.